What's poppin', it's your boy TJ, welcome back to the channel, hope everyone is having a good day. Today, we're going over how you can quit your 9 to 5 job and start trading Forex full time. A lot of people are wondering how do you actually get there because they keep making silly mistakes and not progressing in Forex trading. Being a full time trader, does that mean you need to have a supercar or does that mean you need to make enough money to just survive. It does depend on the person, but I will get into this video and teach you how you can basically quit your nine to five job and become a full-time Forex trader. In 2022, your boy is uploading one video every two days on the main channel. The Reacts channel, one every two days, also Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Those are my upload days on both channels. I also upload two shorts every single day on the main channel so make sure you are in that free trading group link is down below in the description but without further ado let's get into this video i'm just going based off my experience of becoming a full-time trader and how i actually got here I had to take a lot of losses the only way you can really quit your job and become a full-time forex trader is if you have money behind you. If you don't, it can be quite tricky, but here's how you start. You need a side hustle. You need to be able to do something where you can make money and not trade and lose money. Now, with trading, you need experience. And that can be quite costly with an industry that we're in, that you trade with money. Therefore, you need alternatives. Alternatives are prop firms. These prop firms are out and about. They are the best way to get funded. And we're not talking get 200K. Get a $10,000 account. 1% is $100. You can start compounding these accounts. Every time you pass, you buy another one. You claim, you claim the refund. Like I said at the start, if you trade smartly, not over trading, once or twice a week, you will never fail these challenges. How many traders lose so much profit or lose so much percent, should we say? Just entering on the same day and they lose 3-4%. And then they end up losing a challenge or losing their live account within just a week. I got funded a 400k account, which is a high amount of money to also spend on these prop firm challenges. Which is why I'm urging you to never really go to 200k. You don't need that size. 50k is still $500 per 1%. Remember this. If you can manage to pass the challenge, which I know you will be able to if you keep to a good trading plan, then this is the start of your journey. Once you can compound the accounts and withdraw monthly as a successful trader, even if that's one or 2%, you're still taking money from the industry. You're still a full-time Forex trader. Just because you're not having a McLaren in your drive or living in a mansion, doesn't mean you are not a full-time Forex trader. Obviously, Everyone has different lives. We all have bills to pay and everyone is in different circumstances, which can be tricky But there are alternatives if you can't afford a challenge Then try and win a prop firm giveaway and get it like that and pass once you pass you can honestly quit the nine to five Routine should they say even if I'm not trading I'm doing other stuff on the side. So I'm a full-time Forex trader. I make YouTube content I have other YouTube channels I have Instagram pages, play football, go to the gym, study other industries, which allows me and opens up more opportunities for myself because I'm learning and I'm focused on me. What I learn builds me. And that's the most important thing you got to take from this video. Yes, you're on this grind to get funded. To get funded, it can be difficult, but it doesn't have to be as difficult as what people might assume it actually is it's very very simple you need to have good risk management set up a very very disciplined trading plan and slowly but surely without rushing and this is a human chemical issue with most with every human that they have to try and understand is that you have to look at the end goal and not rush things and have patience when you start learning and start developing all of this, you'll start to have the puzzles fall in place and everything will just work out, trust me. It's been your boy TJ, thank you for the support on all the videos, I'm going to keep smashing out. Thank you for watching, like and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you on the next one, peace.